corridor rather than kicking it long to that pocket where all the Melbourne numbers are. So it's a low short one to Crouch and now a hand pass. Hinge long to the teeth of goal. Dawson edged out his opponents. That has been paid the mark. Simply must go through. The captain wants to inspire his side to a memorable comeback. For the fifth time today, Adelaide have been in front four times. That's how tight it is. Adelaide get another look. And so does Taylor Walker. The captain has pushed forward. Spotted by Walker. Dawson got it. Just the one goal this season coming in today, Jordan Dawson. But that one gives Adelaide back the lead. <laughs> well, the looks Dawson. Led. Dawson getting on the end of it. Parrish knocked it out of his hands. On the ball. Goes against Parrish. That's just silly. They've worked that hard to get a three-goal lead. You have a free kick up in the middle of the ground and then to give it 52. Probably one of the better kicks of that late team. 35 metres out directly in front here, Jordan Dawson. They desperately need this and he squeezes it through. They claw their way back to 15 points. Haven't been involved for the whole game. And most importantly, the players are involved. Dawson is a man leading the charge here. He's really stepped up four or five touches the last few minutes. And he does, and a lack of attention once again. Little things at the moment are happening. Adelaide are capitalising. Dawson noses him. This is unbelievable here at the moment. Cook, who's doing it at both ends at the moment, to Hamill. They want the corridor, they get the corridor. Hinge inside, nicely delivered to Dawson. Captain finding it a lot. Tex, the band conductor, as Jared said, gave it back to Dawson. Almost within his wheelhouse here. Goes long and goes all the way home. Stops and on the back pedal. Back to Smith who started all this. Shields his eyes from the sun. Crouch. Picking their way through them nicely. 34 possessions last week. He gave it off to Dawson from outside 50. He grabbed it on the way past like he was getting a shake from the drive through Williams gets out early, took down O'Brien and then took the Sharon. They need some inspiration from somewhere. Saligo stole it. Rochelle, a bullet. Burgess moved forward. Oh. Dawson on the run by. Needs a bounce. It's all working to plan for the Crows. Getting it to sit up. Oh, good to see Isaac Rankin back. Saligo, nice clearance win. To Laird, they're having some good stoppage success early in the Crows. Blakey with a spoil. Some pressure from the Crows again. Picked up by Dowling. Did well to get it to Dawson. And the captain's got goal number four in the first turn. Dawson. Garcia overcommitted. Dawson turned, went to Keys. Got hands on it, couldn't mark it. Scholl delayed it to Berry in some space. Little nudge. Got a kick away back to Keys. Hands it off unselfishly. Rankin, you know he's got to put this through. He gave it off. Gave it to Berry. Bad option. Good option. Bad option. Good option. <laughs> got the handball back again. Dawson. All part of the grand plan. Trying to funnel it out. Got into some space. Adams threw it out. Umpire cut him slack. Dowling. Crouch. One last roll of the dice, a mark from this kick, and they can have a shot. Dawson, front spot. Umpire's found a holding free. Didn't need a mark. All it needs is a free, and it'll be a free kick to Jordan Dawson. Well, the Swans have kicked six goals in this turn, and the Crows are yet to register one, so let's just see if they can nail one after the siren. Well, he knows where they are here. He's an ex-Swan. This was his old home ground, and that was like shelling peas. Good way to finish the quarter for the Adelaide Crows. A half foot.